It is the time! It's a new month, which means a wrap up. Hello, my name is Sarah. Welcome to my August wrap up. I think I read nine books. Obviously, you can see that this is nine here, but I read some like mangas, but they're gone back to the library. Anywho, let's go. First book Baby Love by Jacqueline Wilson. Probably the most traumatizing book I have read in a very long time. I gave it three stars. Don't exactly know why. So the main character is 14. Her friends are toxic. Her family's toxic. What's new? It's Jacqueline Wilson. So she's at the pool with her friend and these French 16 year olds come up to them, hit on them. Slight pedophiles. And then one of them kind of pressures her, the main character, into having sex. She gets pregnant. She has to go to a women's home for young people to have her baby. It's traumatizing. So the next book on a happier note is The Novice by Taryn Matharu. And this is a Pokemon X Harry Potter book. It was literally on Wattpad before it became a book. And so I read the first book and I read the second book. And they're middle grade slash, they're not middle grade, what am I saying? They're young adult, but like on the younger side of young adult. The main character Fletcher, he's an orphan, but he can summon demons. God damn Fletcher! I think he's 16, so it's kind of that in that area. There's not a lot of romance, which can be good or can be bad for you. And it's set really in the school for the first book. Then they really go into the nitty gritty of war. Not really war. Um, do you know like YA war? That's a thing. Um, but yeah, I really recommend them. I get the first book three series, the, four, the second book four series. And I'm on the third book right now. So the next few books is in the Fallen Kingdom series by Morgan Rhodes. So I read book number three. Um, I think this is book number four. And book number five. So this is a high fantasy Game of Thrones wannabe series. Um, it's literally like Game of Thrones but less um, sexy or smutty. There is a lot of vulgar, there's a lot of gore. I personally couldn't connect with any of the characters besides Felix because they're a bit on the younger side and they're really Im like immature most of the time with their decisions. But the series was okay. I also read Death Note volume 10, 11 and 12. The end of the manga series. I liked it. Didn't like the last one though because of what happened. Villains for the win. 